Also breaking this afternoon, a 16-year-old is facing charges in the stabbing of another teenager in Whitman. Crime scene tape surrounded a home on Belcher Drive there overnight. The victim, we're told, is expected to survive. Now the suspect will be facing assault charges. WBZ's Christina Rex is live in Whitman with the very latest. Christina? Kate and Chris, a big group of the victim's friends are actually here at the police department trying to get any information they can. They tell me this started as an argument between, between two teenagers before it turned violent. Now, police did confirm that this altercation actually happened at the suspect's house. They say the two boys knew each other and there was some sort of argument that likely started on social media that ultimately led to the stabbing. Now, a 16-year-old boy who's a student at Whitman High School was arrested last night. The victim in this case is also a 16-year-old boy. He suffered serious injuries, but as you said, is expected to make a full recovery. Police say there's still a lot to learn about this situation leading up to this stabbing. Oh, obviously, I mean, you know, we're talking about juveniles here. There's nothing that I can imagine in your life at the age of 16 that is, could possibly um, cause the death of another person. So, but on social media, there's going to be a lot more said and a lot more out there. I mean, you, we have kids showing up here today. I mean, kids were at the hospital. I mean, this isn't, you know, it's not going to be a secret. That's for sure for long. I can tell you that. Like, what is wrong with you? Like, I never thought he was capable of doing something so horrid, disgusting. Yeah, and the suspect was expected to be arraigned in Brockton Juvenile Court sometime this morning. Because both he and the victim are under the age of 18, police are not releasing their name. Live in Whitman, Christina Rex, WBZ News.